As you guys may or may not know, George Not Found is a member of the Dream Team. He's most well known for being a part of the Dream SMP and also being Dream's best friend. He also has a podcast with like Carl Jacobs. I'm just gonna say, all right, the only reason that this guy is, is really popular is because he's friends with Dream. I, I really don't see anything in hugely special uh, about this guy. And I know it sounds like I'm being mean, but I, but I, I just wanna set the scene for what what exactly is going on here because it turns out a lot of the minecraft community a lot of like minecraft stands a lot of dream stands actually really don't like george and this would contribute to him getting a lot more shit than was deserved now i'm sure you guys know that a year ago or so technoblade sadly passed away now since then his father techno dad you probably know from technoblade's final video where his dad announces that he passed away well he's really been getting involved with the minecraft community sort of just kind of being there for technoblade's old fans he's ran several charity events and a few days ago he would do yet another one of these charity events and during this event george not found is like messing around with a, a soundboard because discord just recently added soundboards for some reason now at first everyone just kind of takes this as a joke but tommy in it makes a comment that like he's gonna get mad if someone starts doing this while techno dad is speaking hey guys we just have to get as far as we can before the streamers realize discord's out of the soundboard future and then we're all good oh f what did i just say oh, hello if anyone does it during Tanner Dad's speech, I'm going to work out who it is and send you all to shame them. And that is exactly what happens. Like, immediately, Techno Dad's giving his speech, and George Not Found is clicking on his soundboard, just kind of being a nuisance to which Tommy would end up calling out George. George would try and lie and say, no, it wasn't me. It was also other people. Hello. Hi. I am having the greatest time. Uh, okay. yes. <laughs> Oh, it's, it's George! He's literally George! George, don't do that. It's annoying. Mm, that's not me. George, I watched no, your name yes, go green, is. George. We can see you do it. It's, it's not me! Lie. It's George! It's you! You have an issue with your computer, George. Really, George? In the charity me. event? It wasn't me! I, I saw that it was you, George. In the charity it was, event, It was George. more than just me. It was other people, too. Really okay, nice. blame them. Who was it? Wait, that's crazy. I, I don't cool. know. I didn't see. Which, okay, kind of messed up. Like, it's a charity event. You're, you're, like, messing up the guy's speech. But at the same time, Techno Dad doesn't really seem at all phased by this. This is for George, charity, George. George, George of the jungle. George, this is a charity George. event. And if you want to ruin it, that's George. cool. Making but making sounds. I didn't do anything, it wasn't me. George, come on, George, man. George, I'd really, come on. It does kind of seem like George was just messing around. And so Tommy in it, just clearly joking around, would ask people to cancel George. Dream uh -huh. Team, roll up in here, ruin charity. Jesus Christ, do they have no respect? If you could all just go and cancel him for me. And they they would do this literally. It, it wasn't a, a joke for for the people on Twitter. And I think it's because what happens following that, because Tommy and and a few others in the chat start asking, "Yo, George, like." Are you, are you donating to this charity? Like, here you are, being a nuisance, being annoying. Are you even contributing to this charity? You're a millionaire. Again, it does seem like people are kind of messing around, but George is just kind of left speechless. George, so how much have you donated? <laughs> Given you're like a, you know, multi billionaire. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, not a lot of sounds now, George. <laughs> and George I'm about to start feeling quiet. real disappointed in you. I'm not feeling it I, yet, but I'm, I'm did, about to get there. You tell know? me before the event that he didn't plan on donating anything. I'm <laughs> incredibly disappointed. I believe that. That's, that right. sounds like him. That is that definitely like something him. he would do. Yeah, George is awful. Uh, the awesome. energy, the vibes we are giving off today. <laughs> it, it, it was pretty clear that, that he was like caught up in this moment. And so that's when Twitter would do its thing and they would cancel George. Oh, that's George not found. Belittling a charity for his deceased friend's family and not actually 
actually donating to it on my timeline. Even his friends are disappointed in him. This clip is uncomfortable, but you can genuinely sense how annoyed he made everyone, and he just laughs. George, this is a charity event, and if you want to ruin it, that's cool. Tubbo, Tommy, and even Dream of all people sound annoyed by his behavior in this. What the F is up with him, genuinely? Techno Dad deserves so much better. He put so much time and effort into an event that remembers and honors his son. And Golden Child, annoying ass, veggie tails looking motherfucker. George Not Found just had to ruin it. Grow the F up. George Not Found gets babied so much by his fandom, and this is what happens. A almost 30-year-old being completely disrespectful and downright disgusting during a charity event that was held in honor of his friend who died of cancer. And this person is uh, apparently saying that even George Not Found's own friends don't like him, and I, I guess this clip proves that. So what you guys don't know about George is he's like an actual like he says <laughs> shit, he that, says shit to me that like if he wasn't like my like really good friend that I've known for years that I just would genuinely not be friends with this guy. Actually, well, he I'm says he says I'm fucked up shit. He just he just skipped around saying best friend by the way. I'm not gonna ignore yeah, that. He was gonna yeah. say we all are, I, I swear. Like, I swear. <laughs> so you're toxic as shit. He is. He's like like he he'll, he'll say some shit that I'm like. Damn, if I hadn't known this guy for years and years now, like, I just would not talk to him. Now, I'm not gonna lie, okay? I'm actually starting to feel a little bit bad for George Not Found. I mean, sure, like, he was rude playing the, the soundboard or whatever. You know, maybe he should have donated to, to the charity or whatever. But he was, like, he was a part of this. He, he was streaming it. He was contributing. His fans were pitching in, donating. And I think Twitter just did what Twitter does, and they completely overreacted here. I mean, this is in Technoblade name that they're canceling George Not Found. Do you really think that Technoblade would have cared that George played a, a soundboard during his dad's speech? I don't I don't think he would care. In fact, I, I wouldn't be surprised if Techno himself would do something like that because that's that's just the type of person Techno was. He, he didn't take things so seriously. I, I, I really didn't know that like this many of these Minecraft stands just absolutely despised George Not Found. Like, like it seems like these people are just on edge. To cancel anyone like no matter what i mean a few months ago like tommy in it was canceled again for like making a joke about dreams allegations are you why do you keep calling me your pet no I don't it's, want not some, like, you. it's not directed at you it's not directed at you i'm not just i'm not gonna add you on snapchat okay not, just fucking bro, back off all right bro this what is like the I'm not okay? what the fuck? I'm not I, you don't call me your little pet all right I'm a man I'm a big man I literally right? wasn't even me. talking to you I was talking to I was talking to Gusso I was talking to Gusso out which is just like okay I didn't even cover that cuz it, it was stupid it's it's just dumb like th these th these Twitter stands they they just cancel people over the dumbest shit imaginable and it's it's pretty clear from these clips that like everyone is joking around like all these guys are friends joking around I I I I really don't see the big deal here Anyway, these are just my thoughts on this entire situation. If you guys have enjoyed, be sure to hit the like button down below and subscribe to the channel.